For today's mini challenge, you'll be required to make your very own RuPaul chocolates molded from my very own anus. Now available on iTunes. Huh. And for the maxi challenge today, we're asking that you make a dress out of your scrotum sack from the fabrics provided on the wall from Fabric Planet. <laughs> <laughs> we tried something a little bit different, kiddos, but you know it's the, the truth. We want to switch some shit. Up. I know, I know, I know. But <laughs> thank you again for joining us here at Maddie Rants with your boy Maddie Rants and our guest host today, Jamar eighty four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's and up? we got to say that this was the final episode before the reunion episode, which is going to be premiering next week. Thank God we don't have to wait two weeks for it this They're time. They're taping it as we speak. Uh, okay, shout out to Rebecca, who's out there right now, <laughs> love. Um, but I got to say, this episode actually didn't disappoint. Thankfully so, because I was worried. <laughs> <laughs> like, who's left? But um, we also had a surprise turn of events as far as... Whether or not, but we'll get to that in a second because Jabbar's got lots to say. Superman, the post. Oh, fuck me. Oh. Okay, sorry. I just saw your necklace and I had to just like totally. Oh, okay. Well, at first I was like, what the fuck? And then I was like, oh, okay. He, I'm, it, I'm all cool. in, it all in a matter of seconds. Come from all in a matter everywhere. of seconds, I had that realization. They come from everywhere. But I got to tell you, kids, um, the, the episode was category is. And, you know, they actually had the runway music, a remix of the version from the Butch Queen album, if I'm remembering this correct. And um, we is were, it really? yeah, it's from the Butch Queen album. And well, the they said there's a remix version. Well, you know what I'm talking about. We you know when the runway goes and its category is dun 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 dun, dun versus the category is Butch Queen up. You know the one from that album. So this week's episode was. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh, back. sorry. We had a laugh. So this week's episode was Category Is, and the girls were actually showcasing and stunting tonight. They're basically working with Todrick Hall from um, this for the season nine remix of the Category Is song, mm -hmm. now available on iTunes. Hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> you know. It should be. We, they we put Riju you, wrote you out. They should I know. So we'll assume you... that should be on there very soon. I actually kind of want this one this time. I know. This time. Well, nah. we wouldn't we read you, wrote you too, but not all of it. Like People, somebody, three fourths some, of. Everybody on YouTube edited out a specific verse. <laughs> because y'all even, even though mm. we read that verse, it is iconic for being so bad. Uh, I make it clear. People make that joke Can't. all the time. <laughs> Like, even secretly, nobody even does Alaska's oh, verse. Lord, secretly, and I don't do it either. I skip but, right to Detox and Katya. But, okay, so, no shade. I'm just saying, like, you, Alaska. them two, Detox and Katya, shut that shit down. Okay, so basically, they had to write a rap verse for the uh, Category Is remix that they were doing. They also had to learn choreography because they were going to perform it on the main stage. And then they had to, of course, perform it on the main stage. I slightly wanted a music video. I, I'm about to say, I think this is the first time... They didn't do read you wrote you. Well, for an actual season Why didn't though. They do read you wrote you. For actual yeah. season though, like yeah. usually, like last year they did the realness, which I. It's real. It's real. Yeah. Well, the song category is has been out for a while, so I think that's why she was it really wasn't trying to push that to then you know for the American album that's already there. Which also I was wondering why didn't we do an, a song from the American album? Why well, just use Kitty Girl? We thought that was gonna happen tonight Call too. Call me mother. So, oh, we. Oh, that sh Oh, that, that would have been that it. Down. That would have been it. That, that would have been it. I would have to step through the screen. Okay. Move, bitches. So Michelle came in and gave them all that tea. So kids, we're just gonna go ahead and cut to the rap. And all the other parts that <laughs> well, happened the, too. The rehearsals. The, the rap, the interview. Well, yeah, well, I Do guess we the rehearsals. Do we really able to talk about those interviews? I mean, just lightly, you know what I mean? Because we know that what they're for. We know that they don't yeah. even use that audio ever again. Yeah. So yeah, okay. We'll talk about it. We'll talk about the the before, the before and the after. There you go. I always thought we were talking about the buffoonery. What buffoonery? What happened? That's just what I thought you were gonna say. Oh, because my, <laughs> I'm always saying something like fuckery. Thanks for utilizing that, my fans out there, because I love saying it just as much as you do. Um, the rap verse. Shay was trying to get <laughs> Twister in the studio. Where is Twister? Probably somewhere trying to get his words together because he over talked that tongue so bad. But you know, Twister, if you know who we're talking about, for those who care, overnight about celebrity. Uh, that that was like the easiest one, but you have to go in like That's... the old tracks, like the first album and the second album. Like I grew up with Twister. I forgot. Whole another household for me. Um, <laughs> but she seemed to finish strong. Now mm -hmm. Trinity, we knew, we knew, y'all knew. <laughs> I can't wait for the Matthew. She was a 
she look okay this is what trinity's problem was at least from what they showed because you know they have to show the shady parts trinity tried to fit words that were like three and four syllables in a beat where it couldn't fit and it didn't belong and she tried to put like in what is she it was a, it was a word i can't remember now i know she tried to fit like plastic parts plastic parts all up plastic in parts me. all up inside of me you see how your mouth has to do a lot of work plastic to try to get all up inside of me like da, 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 get da, your, da, da, your addiction da, da, your mouth da, da. had to do too much work and the it, the flow wasn't right it, it really that wasn't really her right. best <clears throat> yeah that wasn't her best so that was again trinity's been doing so well so it was kind of like hard to see her go huh for that part now peppermint this is what Peppermint does. We know okay. better. We know better. Peppermint just She did that. Performs. It was good. It the, the rap <laughs> the, the rap part with Todrick was great. She kind of pulled it together. That was good as well. Sasha's was, you know, strangely weird as she Sasha was. Sasha sound. It. I think I swore Sasha used the same line that she used in Clat. Oh. Something about is something is art, drag is art, something like that. That sounds very familiar. Art and drag and... And Peppermint was all. Lions, tigers, and bears. Oh my! But you know, that that's, that's <laughs> Sasha for you, honey. She gives you Chronicles of Narnia <clears throat> realness. And we saw that last motherfucking week. But listen. Speaking of... Uh-oh. Because we forgot to mention this at the beginning. We did? Sasha said, I felt like I should have won last week. Oh. I actually wore rainbow. Oh. I was like, Shade. did you? Uh oh. Did you? Somebody <laughs> on the keyboard right now. Uh, they can type if they want to. She did. She did. Shay had on more colors than Sasha. <laughs> Shay was but in the rainbow though. It it wasn't like. But then again, the sexy unicorn. Colors. Sexy unicorn was a category, and that wasn't sexy unicorn. But, See, okay. The one thing about art is it's always subjective. So that's why we can't just say. For Sasha both did very well. Could be I'm not going to say because Alexis Michelle was standing right there, so she couldn't. Baby, be worse. Alexis Michelle was just. She did very well. I don't think she should have won. Okay, um, so Jamar got that point out. Everybody, congratulations. She said it. Uh, but I agreed with him, and y'all know I agreed with him because you felt so forcefully about it last week. So um, let's go ahead and get into the interview just lightly here. Peppermint talking about the mix between transgendered uh, lifestyle versus drag lifestyle and how some people felt that she couldn't cross them or go in between where in the I South, Houston, honey. At least in Houston. I yeah. can't speak for everywhere oh, else. Oh, the South too. Just the South in general. Lots of trans but, people who are drag drag queens as well that always are performing. Most of the ones I Shit, see TCs, are trans. Bitch. I'm going to say most of the ones that I see regular performers are trans mm -hmm. girls because can you think how much time you save already having tits? Okay, you don't have to worry I mean, about press play. Right, you don't have to size already, it up. You already know what your, your body, body size is Your body is already given. feminized. Right. All you have to do is breathe, put the clothes so on. So I right thought now. that was really interesting <clears throat> to hear that, especially out in New York, where I always assume it's just a little bit brighter on that side of the fence versus over here. But, you know, that was something that she struggled with. And again, we also have to think about how long Peppermint has been on this earth. Now, yeah. um, and that was no shade. I'm just being real for those who have lived through more than we have. Um, now, Sasha then had her moment where she explains how she's more of a thinker and uh, discussed her mom's death and how she wished she could have shared that moment with mm -hmm. her in drag where, you know, I can definitely relate to that and wish I could share more of my life with my mother, but she's no longer here. So but that's I, good. I was with Sasha with It's that good that one. she said that, you know, the last few or I think it was maybe two or three months. She gave a, she gave a little bit, was, you know, more, yeah. but, you know, you always she wish was she there. had more time. Exactly. She was there for the last part. So even though she didn't get to see where Sasha is now, she was able to see the progression part and right so i'm glad that they had at least that moment and then um <clears throat> we have to get into shay discussing her living in a white neighborhood and then ending up always going to a black church and either she was too black for the white neighborhood or too white for the uh, black church and you know i can say i have lived that moment being in an all-white neighborhood and then going to then an all-black school I wouldn't, uh, and it was like lord jesus People looking just, uh, looking at shay like if she if she hadn't said that, I wouldn't have guessed that she was raised in a white neighborhood. It's I, more so about then, her character. But it's like, what makes certain... you blend in with a black neighborhood? Like, mm -hmm. as, a, as a black person, 
Like, is it because I use all of my syllables? I think what is she it... probably was referring to is where she went to church was not considered maybe the nicest area where it was more predominantly black, Hispanic, whatever you want to put in whatever category for like a project or a hood or something like that, or in a predominantly black neighborhood. Like we have out here in Houston in certain places you go to, you're not going to see a lot of white people. And then, whereas mm -hmm. if you go somewhere else and you have a white neighborhood with, and I'm sorry to use it like that, y'all, this is just a reality. This is a real conversation people have every day. So hear us out on this. Where if you're in like a white part of town, you're not going to see too many things that are of ethnic cultures. Like I'm not going to find a Jamaican restaurant down the street, but bitch, let me go down to uh, good old Westbrook, honey. I'm going to find <laughs> three on the same street and I know which one to go to. There's just people businesses know where to put their business for demographics. Right. And that also plays the same facts in church because church is a business. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh boy, is it? Mm -hmm. Y'all watch Green Leaf? Ooh! That's another day. <laughs> That's another day. Green Leaf is good. That's a mess. Um, okay, and then we get to... Where we go? And then Trinity, when they said Birmingham, Alabama, I screamed. And shout out to all my people from Birmingham, Alabama watching. You're still my family. I lived out there for two years and I love mm. them to death. I came out there. They're like, where are you from? A lot of my family is from Alabama. Child. M most, all of my family is from <laughs> there, but everybody has moved around. But, um, They're I was... Montgomery mostly, but... See, mine's in Huntsville enough. and Birmingham. But, mm -hmm. um, you know, we around the way. Ooh, around the way, girl. Shaka, shaka. Okay, uh-uh. I, I, I love now, that song. Trinity's story is I feel like a lot of people have had similar issues where they had, you know, not everybody is fortunate enough when they come out to come out with a warm welcome. Uh, a lot of them have a bumpy road where their elders, especially grand, like she was dealing with a grandparent. We have issues with our parents who were sort of still on the, you know, the negative side, but they have been more of a witness to the positive aspects <sighs> as to where grandparents, no. Yeah, they, they said not they're more even, set in their ways. Uh, not everybody. Not all of them. But not all of them. It's but the majority. more common yeah. to know that a grandparent probably has a, a more likely less view of gays. So. Especially in the South. Yeah, so she was born in Birmingham. And, and so I, I don't know Birmingham. Bitch, so. She mentioned how she and her grandma had a uh, falling out right before she passed away. And the last words that she said to her was, I hate you. And, you know, when you're in the, the pits of, you know, argument, you say a lot of things that you don't mean. And it's going to always haunt her that you, you know, left saying the worst thing you could say to somebody as they left this earth. And she raised them and she always said, even though she was the best parent I could have asked for. And it's just unfortunate that they had to part ways on such a negative note. So we all got What I have to say to Trinity for that one and for anybody else that has ever dealt with that, don't ever hold that to you don't let it hold you down you need to remember that probably more like rupaul said i'm guaranteeing now if she could see you right now they could really look at you they'd be more proud of you than ever and they all still love you regardless of what was said so you know shout out to trinity there because that was a real touching moment on the show i really like that now we need to get into the motherfucking choreography the before story. before they actually had the showcase <coughs> now peppermint we knew that was gonna be just fine Miss Thing was working it. Miss Thing was working it. Uh, poor Sasha. Poor Sasha. Todrick. <laughs> he did that on purpose. I said, Sweetie. That's like light setup. <laughs> I love Todrick. <laughs> he knew better than to get Sasha that choreography. He said, we're going to make your Okay, we're going to do ta 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 Boom. Ow, ow, cat, cat, cat. Down, oh, duck, walk, duck, walk, <laughs> duck, walk, duck, walk, spin, da, 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 down. And Sasha was looking like, what? Oh. Now, I, I, I will commend Sasha. She, she gave the, the pageant answer. She said, are you sure you want to do I'm this? I'm going to try my I'm best. I'm going to raise to the, the challenge. I'm going to uh, rise to the occasion. I said, okay, come on now, Sasha. She, Which is good to have that attitude. That's a great attitude, but What we'll get into the final product. Now, um, I'm going to go ahead and say that um, Trinity... <laughs> I said, this thing's rhythm was all the way off, Miss Girl. I was like, come on, Trinity, get into it. And again, like, it's a lot to learn within a short amount of time. And, and some you know, the editors don't... have to show them the worst part. So yeah. we know that usually they get like at least a day. Because mm -hmm. they're, they're doing like, what, two eight counts? If you have a full... 
12 hours, you're going to eventually get it. No, you're gonna, you're this gonna is know probably the first girl. 30 minutes that we're seeing. So It was a little rough. It's it, not fair. It was rough. It was rough trade. <laughs> That's a Eureka reference from the princess episode. <laughs> Oof, trade. Oh, that was so funny. Sorry. Okay, and then Shay. Easy. Boom, boom, boom. Done. Shout out to those background dancers. Oh, the Ooh. background dancers was Working. Even when Trinity was sitting there, no, the Trinity was sitting there like a deer in headlights. You saw them uh, in the background. Cat, cat, cat. Whoosh. Oh. <laughs> I was like, okay. They know what I to said, do. All, they all they right know what that. to do. Now, um, <laughs> we need to go ahead and get into the runway because after all of the shenanigans, the fuckery, and the shockery of it Ooh. all. Wait. You have another point? Then we forget that I'm forgetting. When Are we forgetting? Shay was doing her thing. That mm. she does. Oh. Trinity was just like seething. This is not good. Peppermint gave to, her normal face. I'm that, about to trip this bitch. I'm gonna have to throw She some said, throw. what was it? It was a uh, Tanya Harding moment. Right. <laughs> She's, I'm gonna I'm so, see, this is why we have to keep Peppermint show the entire girls. show. There we because go. Peppermint get there should be an award. Like there's miscongeniality. There should be <laughs> an award for the best professionals. Because <laughs> Peppermint just be Hilarious. Like, oh, okay. Like, like I thought I had this down. <laughs> this came for me. Shook. But um, I got to tell you, um, after all that, I'm glad they kind of moved this forward a little bit. I was like, yes, move it forward. We get to the runway. And we see RuPaul in her promo dress mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. that I'm kind of glad that we got to see in full array. And I thought it was, again, one of the best looks she's done this season. So back to back, you've been you say oh, the yeah. last Ooh, two looks because last week, oh my god, I'm still snatched. Oh my god, last week, <laughs> I'm still snatched. That fucking wig. That really, if 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 she wore any other wig, it would not have it. No, that wig was the focal point of that look. It was like her made. Now I listened to somebody's race. podcast. They were talking about her her dress looked like uh, the topping that they put on cakes. The little, what's the, the little, you know, we design the edge of cakes. The You're little talking sprinkle. about the little fond, the not fondant. I think maybe it is. I don't know. <laughs> the little shit that they have in the big yeah, the little, sack. Little, little, yeah, 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 yeah. They said they just made a whole. Why did I make a noise for what it was? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, you mean the wump? <laughs> Y'all know <laughs> what you're talking about, but they said that her whole dress just looked I'm, like that. But I mean, it was still beautiful. It worked. <laughs> Are you mad though? Oh. Okay, so RuPaul looked great. They rushed it through. Okay, kids, let's go ahead and get to the performance. And the first thing I said, they better do category is right. Peppermint. Peppermint started off the show. Now, we knew Beach. that Peppermint could do this because we saw her uh, at the uh, release the premiere party. We saw her lip syncs. <laughs> and we saw her Britney in the Kardashian thing, so we knew Peppermint could give. And we, yeah, and let, yes, we all need to remember her fucking up Macho Man, like fucked it up. Okay, let's share Miss Thing. Oh my God. So okay, you do that <laughs> while I do the Lexus Michelle turnaround. <laughs> and that was Lexus Michelle this season. Woo. Okay. Because her looks. Yuck. Mm. Anywho, we'll get to that runway too, because I'm gonna talk about Peppermint's dress. Did you but imagine if Alexis Michelle had to do this challenge. Girl. <gasps> Could you imagine if Alexis Michelle had to do this challenge? I don't think we'd be having a good time with this video if Alexis Michelle. We would have already challenge. started off like, bitch. <laughs> how dare you ruin RuPaul's Drag Race? Y'all know how y'all love. I love Category Is for those of y'all because it's one of the never best promoted RuPaul that, songs. He never promoted that song. He it's never one released of the best it. Ones, yeah, you just have to really go into RuPaul's albums and just find these gems. And if you're about the Vogue mm -hmm. beats, if you're about the house music, if you're about that good old runway walking music, that's the motherfucking Category song. Is do 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 do. Do, it's do, Ru do, do, it's do, do. RuPaul, Michelle Visage. I swore, I could swear to God that that was Laganja in the background doing that one little part. Like, I know it wasn't, but it just gave me that with the, I don't know, it was like, What category are we on right now? What category are we on right now? Femme queen realness. Like, it, it's ball shit. And again, Backdoor bearhood butch queen. <laughs> if you haven't seen Paris is Burning, you're not living. You're not living. You need to see Paris is Burning. Like, it is essential for that song as well because the category is... Finally closed. Okay. Da, 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 da. Peppermint, sh shut it down after we went on this two-minute rant about something else here. Um, this is what we do here. We rant. And you will live and breathe for oh, it. we also said... What about... Our, um, our good sis, Miss Nina Bonita Brown, if they took Sasha's choreography and that duck walk... 
If Nina Super Benita like, Brown ah, had been ah, in the top ah, four, ah. Miss Singh would have shut down Sasha's choreography all the house way down. But that's not what happened because Sasha made the top four and she deserved the spot because I know y'all are mad because we brought her back up again in the video, but I don't care. I'm back. Deep breath. <laughs> but listen, Sasha. Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay, it. everybody. Okay, everybody. Okay. <laughs> All right, she was doing just fine up until the last part <laughs> when she had to drop. She okay. was okay. okay. She was you know okay. what, Sasha? You started off very well. It was thriller. I was I was here for it. Yeah. She hopped from chair to chair. Yeah. And Gave a scream. Ah, she did mm -hmm, the whole little mm -hmm, trademark thing mm -hmm, from the beginning. Mm -hmm. And then came the duck walk. She was so quick ahead of everybody else. She was, was like, like, okay, okay. It was oh. like she was step walking. Okay, okay. Oh, oh shit, I'm about to leave the floor. But then the floor. when she dropped, <laughs> it was she missed her mark. And she had to basically just fall to the ground. Yeah. Because she couldn't prepare herself yeah. to really death Rue's drop. Rue's face was kind of like, like, went from a cheese to... <laughs> okay. Well, at least she did no, the best No, she didn't do that it. as much for... She did that for the, the, the other contestants. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Um, but, um... I gotta tell y'all. Oh, oh, pull it back down. Ooh, ooh, you have it on. Yeah. Okay, so. <laughs> okay, now Trinity. All right. Okay, let's let's All just right. let's. Are we just gonna are let's, we gonna just do it? You wanna be nice or you wanna be nasty? I wanna be real. Okay, he gonna be real about it. Here's me. I'm gonna give you all the answer you want. Trinity did oh, pretty good. You're gonna make me the enemy she this did, time. yeah. <laughs> We're gonna make me the bad guy again. No, Trinity. She, okay, she did pretty good for where for what it was worth. For what it was worth, and she got that choreography part down that she was having trouble with yes, whenever they're did. doing it. So that I will give her all the kudos for. Yes, and her did. outfit was all right, all right. Go, Jamar. Hey, Trinity, if you're watching, I love you, boo. That's my Birmingham sister. Now, the only really critiques that I have critiques. Critiques. RuPaul critiques. Mm -hmm. Now available on iTunes. <laughs> Is she didn't lip sync the whole part of her, what you call it. If you look very closely, part of her lip sync she didn't do. And I, for some reason, I didn't like the wig. She had on blue eyeshadow and she had a red wig on and a black. What was it? What is it called? What's the. the what? The. The. the what is her outfit called that she was wearing? A bathing suit? Is it just a bathing suit? What's it called? It gave me suit? a stripper's bathing something, suit in a leopard factory. There was something about it that didn't seem like it fit all together, just look wise. And even though she she did get the choreo, excellent. I loved it. But just the lip sync part was a little bit off. And you saw RuPaul was like. Yeah, Ru had a moment. It was like, mm. <laughs> it was like mm. But again, she brought her charisma to that performance, and that is something Trinity has been doing consistently during this entire competition. There we go. But um, okay. Well, do we do, do we do everybody? No, we one? haven't gotten to Shay yet. Okay. Uh, now, kids, kids, kids. Did we have any doubt? <laughs> Let me tell y'all something. Y'all can't deny me Shay Kool Aid. That bitch slayed the fuck out of that. And even when I just had that conversation about the choreo, and I wish they would have switched it with certain people, I don't think she would have had a problem doing anybody else's choreography either. Girl knew what she was doing. She was ready for this whole moment. But of the thing the show. is, like even like with her and Peppermint, they usually perform with background dancers with this type of choreography. So this was basically them doing a nightclub performance on TV. And it was a good <laughs> night too. It was a good night because that drop down, turn around, spin that Shay did. Oh yeah, that she bop, did. Bop. Ow. Drop, come up, and boom. I said, okay, come on now, come on now. Shay said twice in this episode. Just, just, just. Go ahead and crown Just, me. Boop. She meant it. <laughs> she said, go ahead and crown me, kids. I said, all right, Miss Shea Kool-Aid. I love these. I love these. Sorry. It's so, these are so cute. It's like, I want an egg, and I need to use my nip. Yeah, I'm sorry. It's cute. And then if you're about to kiss somebody, they will thank you for putting one of these in their, you know, almost in their mouth. Well, your lips in their mouth. Just don't even. New York, <laughs> New York, New York, New York. <laughs> what is we it? own everything. Ah! We are New York. <laughs> <laughs> I love Audra. Oh <laughs> my god. <laughs>
don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> yes, <I do. laughs> you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> That's why I'm laughing. Okay. All right. Don't you dare edit that out. I'm not. That, that was gold. <laughs> that, was gold. That, that was gold. That, that was gold. <laughs> All right. So the runway looks. Peppermint. Sister. No. Sister. No. Now, I had to ask the question, and I could be wrong. Is this her roast wig? Is this the same wig I she thought wore it was for the her roast? roast wig. I think I'm pretty I, sure it's the that's same That's the same wig. wig. And the dress. Okay, Peppermint. Now, I know I'm pretty familiar how these types of dress that are, that are really, like, big and poofy have to have something underneath to give it that shape. I understand that. But no, it it just was not it was not flowing right. It did not work. It was not moving oh, correctly. It wasn't. It was not your best. It was better than the Pepto Bismol. And it was pink again. Ninety thing. No, it was red. It was. Are you sure? Yeah, oh, it was, yeah, you know, it was, the, the light can tell us you, whatever we wanted. That to we'll say. get to Sasha's dress getting fucked over by the light, but it was red. <laughs> And it just wasn't her best. And I thought to myself, girl, that looks costume. That does not look like a dress that you would just, I don't know. I, I just, ex Peppermint always gives me so much hope. And it's like, oh, I'm like, ha, ah, ha, ah, ha. Ah. I just want to get excited. strengths are, as somebody mentioned it, it's like, she's, she's the type of performer where you're not paying attention to, you don't really have a chance to pay attention to what she looks like because she's performing so well. Yeah. Uh, I agree and that's that. her strength, and that's just it is what it is. It works for her. Now, <clears throat> Sasha, that lighting, you what she wore. that lighting fucked you over. I don't know over. what Sasha wore. That lighting fucked you over. It I was could, magenta. I'll tell I you that. I couldn't even tell you what Sasha. It wore. was magenta. <laughs> I would like to say magenta or a fuchsia pink, but I will I think say it was red. No, because when they red. when they was judging her in, in the when they showed her like a clip around tuck, I think it was red. We'll hold that out. We don't know. I feel because... it was more magenta or a, or a dark fuchsia pink, but my whole. <laughs> thing was that lighting it was swallowed so, her whole like golly it blurred her out completely the fuck <laughs> i was like so how am i supposed to know what the hell this bitch is wearing anywho I'm sure it she looked had it looked good money. it just the From lighting was saw, like i'm sure you had some accessories that were very match. nice i'm sure there were some details that were there and the crown was cute but i just yeah now okay shay kool-aid came out in this beyonce-ish number that both me and Jamar were kind of sitting on the chest part of it because she it, had on the the what explain is it like to me the, what that was it was like either the corset that was underneath with the you know the bra cage that was underneath it or it was the bra itself that was underneath the actual you know what I'm saying? And it just showed, and it wasn't the same it, color as her skin. It so it kind of looked weird. So much that it was the same color. The color was, it was the fact of how they moved. It was it like It didn't this. look like natural breath. It was like, it, The skin folding was moving back and forth, and it was like, it was very distracting. Everything else everything was else. sickening. It was sickening. It just was, I didn't like but. that part of it. I it almost wish she was flat chested for that part. It was like, just very distracting. Not even anything there. <coughs> but I thought it was I I definitely gave me B. I was like, yeah, that's that's Beyonce down. She she'd wear that you just know, not this that thing performs Beyonce and Nicki Minaj. Like all nobody's day long. business. <laughs> right. Okay. Now Trinity Trinity, I want to know how much that dress cost you, girl, because I know you that had to skip a month's rent to pay for it. That fucking dress was I know she had to go a, rent, a, a, a month oh, late on rent to pay for that. That was a pageant <laughs> gown down for all the ages, and then she gave you pageant walk. I was like... Too late. And that slow walk, that pageant <laughs> walk, bitch. I was like, mm. First time we seen her do that. I said, come on, sis. Um, so, yeah, I, I don't have anything more to say other than Trinity, that dress slayed the house down. Side note. Trinity has a YouTube channel where she talks about different... She gave a story on how Alyssa and Eureka were her running up. She gave us some tea. It was a real quick tea. Her and Alyssa were in the back, uh, the back dressing room. And Alyssa, she said Alyssa was trying to trip her up. And she was like, oh, you think you're going to win this, Miss Taylor? And Trinity looked at her and said, you know what? You're going to make an excellent first runner-up. And there's your Trinity story. Back to the show. Bitch. Back no. to the show. I was You're like, not gonna girl, do that, that one minute and 30 seconds was You're like not gonna really, do that. really All trendy. The tangents. Uh, but that was one I didn't care for. She wasn't funny. That wasn't a good story. We can see that on Trinity's page. So now they're on the stage i meant every word and i want to say that they brought up the children's photos everybody laughed at each other 
They didn't do that in other seasons. Did they laugh at each other in other seasons? Probably. I don't think as bad as they did this season. It was kind of like, <laughs> girl, look at what you used to laugh. I mean, Especially when Trinity's picture came up, they all had a cackle. I was like, "Ooh!" Because it was like nineties. Uh, she had that good old that big gaudy jersey. <laughs> that good old what is it? The like the poke, like, not polka dot, but the triangles with all the. It looks like the inside of a mega bus. <sighs> Breathe, Matthew. That was rude. Okay, so <laughs> yikes. Um, <laughs> Peppermint's words Mine when they came so to her. Mm, Peppermint's words. Oh, okay. Mm, I want to get this out, but I'm, I'm constipated. You got to let me get it out. Okay. Ugh. Peppermint said everything. Oh, that was so sweet what she said to herself as a child. She said everything that you feel inside is right, and you mm -hmm. need to start expressing it sooner than later, which uh -huh. totally agree with. And just life Because we could never know... As gay people, we'll never know what it would be, what our journey was going to end up being, because we all just feel we're all the same. We were just trying to make it every day at that point. You know, I was just trying to make it. I was just trying to live. And, you know, most of us don't have anybody to tell us, you know, what you're doing is right. And there's nothing wrong with it. We kind of have to figure it out on ourselves. It's, you're wrong. You're wrong. You need to change this. You're so, doing too much. You're making this face. Your hands are moving the wrong way. You're saying stuff. Oh. That that, P.S. Maddie Rance Diaries is going to be about my coming out story, so just get ready for Sunday because I got a whole lot of shit to talk about there. But Peppermint, I loved it. I felt it. It was there. Sasha's was beautiful. It was, you know, basically, you're going to say all these things about yourself, but, you they're know. They're true. And they're true. <laughs> and spend more time with your mother. And I'm like, I felt that. That touched me too. Shay's was really nice. She got a little emotional. You know, it's going to be okay. Da 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 da. And Trinity's was really emotional too. That's the first time I have seen Trinity kind of break down like that. And I was like, girl, she really is full of Botox. So I didn't see one tear just come out of her eyes. I'm not reading, I'm just saying. I, it was like, you see she wanted to cry, but them cheeks were still there. Trinity's like trained to hold it together. Perfect, professional. Okay, so when it came down to why should they be chosen and why should the others stay, I put one word in, in two, I guess one or two word answers for this. Peppermint, because she wants to be an ambassador. Sasha's was more so like just short and sweet. Like it was just, you know, I should be because of la la la. I kind of tuned out. Uh, Shay, you got it. I was like, okay. And then Trinity, growth. Well, I have grown the most. I caught what Shay said. Shay said that I may have stumbled in the competition one good time, but. I ha basically, I have the most wins. I've done the best in the competition. She basically said my scorecard's better than everybody I'm else's. I'm better than them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but Trinity said I deserve it. I oh, deserve it. I was like, really? Okay. But I write this now. Right. The lip sync was to you. Okay. RuPaul, girl, why? <laughs> <laughs> it was you wear it well, and I'm why like, did why they lip -sync to you was wear it you well? wear it well of all the songs? You could have done Kitty Girl. You could. You really should have done Call Me Mother, but we're not going to talk about that. You could have even. Well, no, 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 don't do that. Let's not do it. But you wear it well. I was disappointed. Now, next on my agenda would be that they all look like scrambled eggs up there. Because you want to be respectful. And they do that at like all the local shows. Like poor. when you have multiple shows, you have multiple people at once on stage. I hate that. They say, don't be disrespectful. Don't be stabbing. Everybody, everybody was being kind to each other's faces. Shay was running to the back like nobody's business. Shay stayed in the back. Baby. You know, she was doing these she's, runway walks all the way up, like, and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. Peppermint stayed in one spot, in my opinion. I really didn't see her go nowhere else but that spot. She went from side to side, I think. You know, and then Trinity Sasha and Shay were in was. The back. Doing all that and this extra, and then Trinity was going across, and then she went back. They were up. both. They were both doing it. Yeah, Trinity so, was like, "Oh, you're doing this. I'm gonna do it too." <laughs> I just kind of was like, "Oh my god, I'm sick of this." I think she should do two versus two, or like two go and then two go, and then we'll have it. Oh, that would be interesting. That would be. It would almost be like a battle royal situation. But, they have to change the song up and everything. Hmm. That's just my thoughts. But kids, no one went home. They all four got to stay. I choose no one to be eliminated. We have a top four. Now, and we felt like that should have been the case RuPaul, for season eight. Bitch. 
there you should have done this last year with Chi Chi. You you know well I can't say you know, but you come on now. <laughs> you you love Chi Chi. We love Chi Chi. You should have kept kind of her. felt like Chi Chi. And you know that Chi Chi should have performed on that stage. I mean, I think that would have been brilliant though. I'm kind of I'm kind of sad that, that I was like I agree. I was like that would have been amazing if Chi Chi had performed on the stage, even if she didn't win, just to get that good just old to get, stage performance. Because I felt Chi almost Chi like shows. they let somebody stay just so we could see them perform. I'm not gonna say who. And I was gonna say that because we, like, we were like, we were like between you know the four because we're we were expecting between, somebody to go. We home. say that Sasha and Shay were clearly in the top two. Yeah. But then it would be t be between Trinity and Peppermint, but it was almost like Trinity's scorecard is much better than Peppermint, yeah, so and Peppermint's got to go home. But all four got to stay, so it was just weird. And I'm, I'm, not, I'm not mad about it, but I'm sure I can't like, wait to get to Twitter. I cannot wait to get to Twitter and see what these girls have to say because what if it had been if like Valentina like... or Nina or anybody else that had been put in that same position with the top four? Would they also have been a top four as well? Uh, I'm just like, why now? And how often will that take place? You might as well just do top fours every fucking season and just save Final the time. Final yeah. instead of no to top threes. Yeah. I don't know. But kind of also excited to see Peppermint perform. Oh, yeah, definitely. Trinity that's, that's perform. A... All of them kind of, like, get their shine to perform. I kind of am excited for that. But it just felt like you could have done that last season. You sh um... Down below, you see the links for where you could reach us at, kids. Uh, Maddie Rants on Facebook and on Instagram and at the Maddie Rants on Twitter. Jamar84 on all sites. Except for Snapchat, which just has an additional four on it. Oh, you got them on your Snapchat? I don't be on Snapchat like that, so... I, uh, it's there. Ooh! <laughs> it's there. I use them sparingly, but it's there. Okay, okay. <clears throat> now, um, I gotta say in the comment section, be respectful, but give your opinions, because we all know how this can turn into a tsunami of fuckery. So, I want y'all to give your honest opinions. Do you agree with having a final four? Do you feel like there should have only been a final three? Are you, how did you feel about the whole uh, lip sync performance the category is? And your thoughts on this episode in general? Also, remember tomorrow we'll be, uh, Jamar, are you going to do Untucked for your um, Jamar 84? Or you More than likely, yeah, I'll do it. Okay. And I'll, I'll be do doing it. Untucked, too. Yeah. Now, you know when you just said Tsunami, which you made me think of, right? Katy Perry. Well, well I'm giving us moments for that. We'll get to that in a second. We'll get to that in a second. <laughs> since I've set that up for a reason. So, everybody, you know what to do. Go ahead and get down that comment section. Tell us how you feel. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Do what you got to do. Now, tomorrow, I'm going to be doing Untucked. Sunday, I'm going to have Maddie Rance Diaries, and I'm going to do a coming out story for Pride Month here. And I have a special treat because I know we were talking about vacations and stuff. I will be going on a vacation on August 19th and 22nd. I will be chronicling that on this motherfucker. So <laughs> all the shenanigans you want to see in Pensacola, I will have it for Panama <clears throat> Beach, Florida. Okay? And speaking of Tsunami. So if you are not already aware, Katy Perry released her newest album, Witness. Why well, Taylor Swift tried to shade her bitch. Taylor that's a whole different. I couldn't. That's a whole I couldn't whole believe it. Different. Okay, no, fuck it. Taylor Swift, goddamn it, she <laughs> she done discounted all her albums to six ninety nine on I iTunes. I said she done put all her albums on every streaming platform. Even, After last was it last year, she made this whole hoopla about getting, artists don't get their money to Spotify. I don't want my music anywhere shady. on this platform. But she decided upon Shady. last night to put all her shit discounted Shady. on all platforms on the day that Katy Perry releases her album. Shady. You shady mother Shady. Bitch. However. I said, you old hobgoblin you. Now. Gotta snipe. <laughs> Ow! I can't. Oh, did you just? I did, and it was <laughs> great. But anyways, check out her album. I will say real quick that do not... Judge the album based off the singles. I liked Bon Appetit and Change of the Rhythm, but we all, we both were kind of like Swish Swish didn't really belong on the album. It really doesn't. I it did, really I, doesn't. I did. It, once it, it comes on, I'm not it, bothered. It, <laughs> I, I, I switch, switch, bitch to the next song. But I think that Tsunami is my favorite. Power is second to that. Deja Vu is third. And I also like Save 
as draft. That's a good one. Like and what's one. crazy is that there was a listening party for that, and mm-hmm. people were like, "What does that mean? What does say?" I'm like, "Have y'all never? Used, have you never have not you never typed used out a word processor before? That you wanted to like seriously like <laughs> okay. get out to someone, but you just don't want email. Girl, have they do never... it on Facebook now. Do you want to save as draft? Do you want to save? They this? didn't get it. There was an article that said, "What does save as draft mean?" Oh, girl, like, oh, the, the generation. I swear to God. But yes, check okay. out the album. It's great. Yes. So thanks again for joining us in our rambling rants. You have yourselves a great evening and see you in a few kids.